Well, it could be the script for a Hollywood rom-com. A glamorous actress gives up her glitzy life to marry a small-town dentist. But this is the real-life love story of a Bollywood superstar who now calls country Australia home. It's been a, like a tornado of whirlwind uh, in my life. It's changed so much. From Bollywood to the bush. Did you know about the sand flies? No one tells you about those. And a love story for the ages. Uh, we actually met on a blind date and uh, we were introduced by a mutual friend who believed that we had a lot in common and they were right. Yeah, she was right. Chinchilla is a small rural town west of Brisbane, population 6,600 people. But the area most famous for its watermelon festival has now been put on the international map thanks to a new star resident. It's a very romantic idea coming to the small town and, you know, living life. Evelyn Sharma is Bollywood royalty. You know you're not in love with me. I am. Oh. I really am. True love. Indian love. Originally from Germany with an Indian father, she quickly rose to fame as a model and movie star when she moved to Mumbai in 2010. Hi, I'm Jenna. Hey. Hey. I got approached by production houses and directors for movies and I signed five films in my very first year. So how does someone so famous end up in little old Chinchilla? turned out to be the best thing we ever did. After meeting in Mumbai, Evelyn started dating Australian entrepreneur and dentist Tashan Bindi, who had just bought this dental practice down under. As the pandemic unleashed on the globe, the couple thought there was no better place to wait out the virus. A big detox almost, mental detox. Um, sometimes I was just lying in my garden on the grass and the butterflies were coming by. It was quite the adjustment for Evelyn. Mumbai has a population of 22 million people. Their paparazzi followed her every move. Hello, ma'am. First couple of nights I slept in Australia, I was like, what is this screaming cat doing? And my husband was like, that's a bird. But Evelyn soon adjusted to country life, finding a new circle of friends at, of all places, the Chinchilla Gardening Club. They embraced me so much, it was lovely. It was like suddenly, like we have about 100 members in our garden club and it felt like I've got all these moms and grandmas. Which was much needed help when Evelyn and Tashan married and then welcomed baby Ava late last year. It's um, you know, this little person that just completely relies on you for forever. Now the sounds and sights of Bollywood are almost a distant memory. Glamorous life, I do miss it sometimes. The red carpets and getting dressed up in uh, beautiful gowns and saris. But today, a little hint of yesteryear, with the family shooting a tourism commercial at the classic Jimbo House on the Western Downs of Queensland. And I still, I remember my first Bollywood movie was actually called From Sydney With Love. <laughs> and I was shooting in Sydney for a month. And um, so just being back on set in Australia has been such a pleasure. For Tashan, it was a first, but a pleasure to be promoting the countryside they've come to love. The allure of the country has always been there. Mm. And they've always had dental practices throughout the country. So for me, when the pandemic hit, there was no other better place to be. Evelyn still shares her life on social media with her three million followers. But now it's the bush rather than the biryani and her newfound love of plants that takes centre stage. It's all come together so well. I, I don't even, I don't even need to, you know, think of what could have been because it's so perfect. The cultural immersion is still a work in progress though with many more classics to watch. It makes me watch the castle, uh, yeah, really you know. To, Kath and Kim. Yeah, make yeah. me understand Australian culture mm -hmm. and kind of immerse myself. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>
accent's not bad. Evelyn says the Bollywood movie offers are still rolling in, but for now, she's content with family life here in Australia.